Hello everyone, this is Direwolf20, and today I'm doing a quick tutorial for industrial craft on the Tesla coil. Uh, somebody, a couple of people I think have requested a tutorial on how Tesla coils work, and they're actually pretty straightforward and easy to use. So let me just knock some of this grass off here, and lay down an MFSU. Start storing some energy in there. And I'm going to hook myself up with just some glass fiber cables. And now Tesla coils can accept medium voltage current, so not high voltage, so you definitely need an MV transformer here. Okay. And you can go ahead and place them in the ground, you can place them wherever you want. It's really up to you where you want them to go. I like to place mine underground, but really, like I said, wherever you want is fine. Okay. So, first off, what you want to know, so let's say we've got 415,000 energy here. Alright, in order to activate this guy, you need to supply it with a redstone current. And I can do this simply by flipping the switch. Ooh. And you can see that I'm going to take some damage, as well as the enemies Ooh. around me. So, the Ooh. pig and the duck that were just there, or the chicken, Ooh. pretty much Ooh. just died real quickly for Ooh. this. And I'm taking some damage Ooh. as well. Um, I'm not getting Ooh. hurt too much because I've got my quantum Ooh. suit on. Ooh. So that's protecting me. And then turning off the redstone energy will pretty much turn off the Tesla coil. You can, of course, Ooh. if you want, run a nice redstone wire across to this thing. So I definitely recommend you not have the lever right next to it. So let's see. Let's get ourselves some redstone. And just run a cable. Now that the redstone's on, Ooh. Ooh. anybody nearby takes damage, turn the redstone off, no more damage. Works pretty well, and uh, kills most things on one hit. Now if we look here, we can see that we drained a significant amount of energy, so let's see, 265,000 charge. Just by activating this, we will slowly be draining energy, about 1 EU per tick. If I get my trusty EU reader here, you can find out exactly how much we're getting, but I'm pretty sure it's 1 energy unit per tick, just to have the thing on, and that's kind of in targeting mode. So it's, uh, you know, draining energy just for the sake of, uh, you know, being able to target things nearby and to zap them. So, I've got my EU reader here. Let's see, what do we got? 1 energy unit per tick. Right, so it makes perfect sense. So you can see, as I was stepping over there and taking damage, it was drawing more energy. So we're up to 233,000 energy right now. One zap brought it down to 223,000. So as you can see, it takes about 10,000 energy per shot. And it's got to recharge after each shot. So that's the Tesla coil. Hope you guys enjoyed checking out this tutorial, and I hope you use it because it does offer a lot of neat opportunities for killing stuff.